Wow, this angle, this angle is playing me. Hi guys, welcome back. In today's video, we're in the bathroom. Okay, I know it's weird, but we've got a lot of stuff under the sink. You know what I'm saying? Under the sink, in the drawers. There's a lot of stuff that's like expired that I don't even really like anymore. I need to, I need to declutter and I'm gonna do it today. Okay, so in my bathroom, our bathroom, <laughs> Tyler has one sink, I have the other sink. Underneath Tyler's side of the sink is Tyler stuff. So the top drawer here is like mostly Tyler's things, so we're not even gonna get into that. It's like his deodorant, aftershave. But I have the middle drawer, the bottom drawer, and all underneath here. I haven't previewed this, I haven't pre-staged this, so this is we're getting real. Okay, we're getting real. Should we start under the sink? Yeah, I think so. Here we go. Okay, this is what I'm working with under the sink. There there's a lot. There's a lot of just stuff. Oh, honey. Oh, honey. Oh, girl. Oh, honey. Oh, honey. I feel like I'm a pretty organized person, so I, I don't know. No. It's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. I do have this over the door hanger. These things are awesome. Why do I have all these hairbrushes? I don't know. I have my... My tiny little hair dryer. This is what I'm, this is my everyday hair dryer. Seriously. Here's all these hair ties that my hair is not long enough for anymore. I have to hide them because Murray takes them. The one that's all chewed up. Yeah, that's a Murray special. Don't look at all the hair that's in these brushes. <laughs> it's horrifying. So I am going to pull everything out and we're going to go through it. So much. So we're going to pull everything out. I want to wipe things down. So I have some stuff to collect the rubbish, and then I have, you know, in case there's some things that I could rehome to somebody who might really enjoy them. Here we go. Okay, all right, so before we get too far into this, hang on a second, let me fix you, you're too low. It's, not, it's actually not that bad. It's really not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. So I have a lot of hair stuff. Okay, so first of all, I have these spiral curling rods. My hair is not long enough to use these, so I'm going to rehome these. These are just regular sponge rollers, critical for Halloween and vintage style looks. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold on to these. These are like, lush containers like the samples i don't know why i was keeping these i do have an empty smoothie star container and what i use this for actually is to clean my beauty blenders so what i'll do is i'll squirt a little bit of liquid soap i like to use this castile soap and then i put the beauty blenders in there put the lid on and then spin them around and that really helps get them clean it's a tip for me to you so i'm gonna hold on to this Obviously need to keep my soap. I'm getting distracted. I was talking about hair stuff. <laughs> I have a can of Aquanet. Why? Um, I've got my Amica Headstrong hairspray. I'm gonna keep that. Obviously my perk up, I'm gonna keep that. Got this r Co dry shampoo. It's nearly empty. I'm gonna keep that. How many dry shampoos am I gonna find today? IGK, first class charcoal tea. I didn't like this. I'm gonna rehome it. Hot off the press thermal protection hairspray. I never use it. I didn't. I didn't really love it. This smells like peaches. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna keep this. This is the weatherproof. And I, I never use it. This is empty. So I'm gonna let this go. Oh wow, why do I have this Barbie detangler? This is nearly empty. And the sprayer I think is broken on this, so I'll just let that go. Styling and finishing spray. I don't I don't remember enjoying this, so I'm gonna rehome that. Ooh, I do love this. This is my favorite hairspray from Bedhead. I'm gonna keep that. Color Wild Dream Coat. Some travel size shampoos. I'm gonna keep these. This is super duper old. Probably expired. This is empty and also expired. Do you guys use this stuff? It's a 10. I don't I don't reach for this. I don't I don't like the way it smells. It's also like half empty. I'll just I'll rehome it. This is tanning lotion. This is what I used to go to the tanning bed. I know it's bad. I used to go to the tanning bed all the time and I used to use the super expensive lotion. That's what this stuff is. Look at this. Whoa, and it's from 2014. This is spray deodorant. I didn't even know I had this. I mean, I guess I could use it. Maybe I'll just rehome it. There's a lot of it missing, but I don't even remember buying this. Let it go. Some nail polish remover. That's good, we need that. I've got my jewelry cleaner. Nair, this is a new thing that I have discovered. I've been using this and loving it, so I'm gonna keep that. There's, I can get rid of this giant package. 
contact lens solution from Halloween. This expires in March 2021. Okay, that's fine. The very last of my Cinema Secrets brush cleaner. We'll just hold on to that. That container is comically large. I use all those brushes. So I'm gonna keep those and the hair dryer I use for sure. This is for my Clarisonic. It's like the holder for it. I never use it. The holder, I mean. Isopropyl alcohol, that's always good. My aloe vera gel, that's good. My slur water, yes. This is my brush cleaning mat. Makeup wipes. Oh, this is one of those towels, like a makeup remover towel. I'm gonna go ahead and let that go. I never use it. Oh, my bum bum cream. Keep that for sure. This I like to keep around for removing super Halloween makeup. Johnson's baby oil gel. I did not know I had this. Loving tan. Wow, okay. I've used this precisely like once or twice and it does work really well. I don't know if is it, does this expire? I don't know. I feel like if I keep it, I'm hoarding. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it. Lingerie Delicates Wash. So old. It smells so good though. Uh, watermelon sleeping mask. Yeah, I said watermelon. One container. And it's a tiny flat iron. Remember when I said I already had a tiny flat iron? It's a little. This is one of those things that maybe I should take it to work. Okay, now let's go through this thing. This is my lash tinting supplies. So I have my Refecto Sill, the container, an emery board. Let me take that out. Pumice stone, oh gross, no. This is medication that I don't take anymore and it expired in December, so we're gonna let that go. Contact lenses from Halloween. I think they might be dried out. These are the lenses from Greta Gremlin. They're all dried up. Like, how does that happen? Let's see who's in this one. Oh no, this one's still good. These are my white out lenses, so let's just keep these. Next is an old Z palette. Don't need this. Stick on nails. These are kind of fun. Oh, I forgot I had these. Oh, see, this is what happens when things are buried under the sink. This is my luxury scent box. Perfumes. I have a sweatband from the Color Run. I don't need this anymore. Lots of tiny little clips. Little hair bows. Why do I have these? Hair rats. I mean, I do kind of use these. I mean, I know that looks terrifying, but I use these when I do costume looks and vintage styles, so like, hardly ever, but I'm gonna keep them. Hair sparkles. You tie them into your hair so that you have sparkles. You never know. I mean, I bought all those for a costume look. I'm gonna keep them. I'm a hoarder. Okay, I'm gonna put this in the bottom drawer. It's hair stuff that I hardly ever reach for. Never reach for. I will put this emery board in with these nail things. So nail stuff would be this middle drawer. Hmm, good plans I'm coming up with. And then this would be my, my lash tinting, my eyelash and eyebrow tinting supplies and my contact lenses. I need to wipe off that top. Let me just move that for a second. And oh, it's all cleaned out, it's amazing. Let me just give this a little wipe. There we are, under the sink. Totally cleaned. So I am going to put this stuff back now. This is all trash that came from underneath the sink. I have this Lazy Susan thing. Super old, oh my goodness. Keep that in here. See, and then you can put your hair stuff on it. It spins around, yes. These need to go in the hall closet. That's where I keep all the travel size thing. Oh, this is exciting. Look, I've got room. So my center container is things that I don't reach for a ton, but I like to be able to just pull the entire container out to be able to get to it. So, so I think that's it for this cabinet. I feel like I got rid of a lot of stuff, but I, I still have I still have a lot of stuff. Oh well. Okay, so let's move on to the bottom drawer. Shall we? Are you ready for this? Okay, so this is <laughs> covered in cat hair. Yay. So this goes to that flat iron that came in my boxy charm that I think I'm gonna rehome to my sister. Here's my regular flat iron. This is a charging cable for my Fitbit. This is the charging cable for my Clarisonic that needs to go upstairs. Curling iron, curling wand, another curling iron. So that's a pedicure tool. Ooh, a comb. Some hair goop, alligator clips. Got my foam roller bag out again because I have these Velcro rollers that I never use. And if I were to use them, it would probably be with something like this. So I'm going to move these out. Got a nice little hair donut. I'm gonna move him in here. More clips, teasing comb, favorite bun clips. My hair's not long enough for these, but 
I'm not gonna throw them away because my hair will be long, maybe, at some point. Am I hoarding? Yes. Hair clips, oh I forgot I had these! These are really beautiful um, tortoise hair clips and spin pins for buns. This is where I keep all my bobby pins, but most of them have fallen out of here, so these two that I just found go in here. More bobby pins, bobby pins, duck bill clips, duck bill clips, duck bill clips, duck bill clips, hair pins, tiny rubber bands. Take this out and wipe it out. This container is filled with a lot of like hair creams and potions and lots of samples, so I'm gonna try to Get rid of some of these. Work through damp hair. Nope, I'm gonna rehome that. This is dry shampoo paste. This is actually really good. I'm gonna keep that. Heat protectant spray, rehome. Thickening style foam, I'll keep that. Thermal shine, wig cap, bun maker. I didn't like this, I'm gonna rehome that. Okay, love this, love this, love this. <laughs> love this. That is sunscreen. Finishing spray, more bobby pins, rubber bands. This is so old, but I still love it. Restyling spray. I do love Oribe, but I'm just not reaching for this stuff. I'll rehome it. Conditioner. This is a glove that you use with that um, wand so that you don't burn your fingers. Forgot I had this. I'll rehome that. Giant hair clips. Love those. Rubber bands. I will put that on my rubber band holder. Ooh, and a big comb that I forgot I had. Ah. I'm not really using these curling irons a lot, so in an effort to just kind of save space, I'm not gonna get rid of them, because I'm not ready to get rid of them, but I'm gonna put the ones that I'm not using kind of hidden away. One curling iron and one flat iron. And that's it for now. Patches. Patches, what do you need? Huh? What? This drawer is a nightmare. Patches. What? Yeah? What is it? Come here. Patches? Come here. Hi. I don't think you guys have met Patches yet. This is Patches. He's an old man. Are you okay? Okay. So this drawer? is a nightmare. This is all my skincare. Oh God. Let's take everything out. Let's take everything out. Oh, hi, Murray. Hello. Here we go. Holy shit. This is a lot. Ooh, another thing of Aquaphor. Okay, that's always good. We're keeping that. Thermal spring water. No, I... This is an old Refecto Sill. I'm gonna go ahead and let that go. Gross, I'm gonna let that go. This is for nails. Detoxifying clay mask, I'm gonna let that go. I didn't like it. This is one of those makeup remover cloths. I don't love it, but I'll try it again. Nail clippers, this is for teeth whitening. These are zip poppers. <laughs> this needs to go down with my nail files and such. These are chewies for my aligner trays for my Mile Direct, my Invisalign stuff. Don't need those. Aligner remover thingamabob. Don't need that either. Let's put the things back in here that I know that I'm gonna keep. So I know that I'm gonna keep my Clairsonic brush heads, tooth whitening, light aquaphor, little tiny razors. These are good for, you know, lining up your mustache or your eyebrows. I'll keep those too, those can live in there. These are brush forms. I definitely did not remember that I had an entire bag of these and I was about to order more on Amazon, so ha ha ha, it's out of the way. I don't remember what vitamins these are. And when you don't remember, don't take them. I'm gonna throw these all out. Total trash, don't buy these. A variety of masks, I'll definitely keep these around. How did this get in here? This is so bad for you. Any of these scrubs with the nuts? Mm, walnut shell powder, oh yeah. So actually, I like to keep this stuff around for like my elbows and feet. I don't really use this on my face, but I'm gonna go ahead and let this go. This is empty. This needs to go upstairs in my empties. I talked about this in a video one time and I love it. Oh, that's another mask. So inside this clear plastic container, I have smaller containers to kind of hold the little things. See what I mean? So it kind of holds the little things. So you 
you can put tall items in here and smaller things that kind of get lost. So this stuff, this vacuum cleaner mask, it's old AF, so I'm gonna let it go. My lavender and tea tree oil. This is a meltdown makeup remover that I really like a lot, so I'll keep that as well. I've got a sample size of cleanser that I actually just got over uh, the last weekend. This is where I keep my teeth, so I'll just put these over here for now. Deodorant is kind of a different thing. This lotion came in a boxy charm. We'll keep that over here. I'm gonna rehome this. This is like nearly gone. I just need to use this up. I'll leave it out so I remember that I have it. This is makeup remover as well. Moisturizer, skincare. We got some lip oil, some congested skin serum that is empty. Serum, that's empty. Wow, I've got so many empties in here. Actually, if this is empty, then this needs to go in my empties. So I'll put that over there. All right, let's go through this. Ooh, my new baby, my La Mer. It is known. It is known. This is expired, pretty sure. This is a soft water peel, six months. Let that go. Wow, these are empty. My ceramidins, these are super old. Wow, this is from 2016, okay. Wow, expired. Um, This says that this is hydrating milky mist, but it's not, I filled it up with just water. I'm gonna let this go. Peel off face mask. This is nearly empty. I need to use that up. Skin polish, that lip line corrector. I'm gonna put this tea tree oil over here with this tea tree oil. Oh, the, I don't even know how old this is. This is definitely expired. That's new. The hell is this? Oh, I don't even know what this is. Illuminating oil gel cream. Okay. Moisturizer, small thing of Luna oil. Lip scrub, I hate lip scrub. That's trash. Ooh, that's empty. Intensive blemish serum. Ooh, some CEO glow. Another thing of tea tree oil. Put that over here. This is definitely expired, 2018. Okay, that's 2017. This is my little La Mer spatula. Eye cream sample. I don't even know where that came from. A hair tie and a little face scrubber. So I'm gonna try to put the smaller things in here in these little small containers. And then this is kind of like my regular go-to. I need to wipe this thing out. This is like my regular go-to skincare. Okay, that is wiped down as good as it's gonna get for now. So I'd like to put like regular skincare items in here as much as they'll fit. So some of this stuff I think is a little bit tall, which is why it's not in here. Like this thing is too tall to stand up in the drawer. So I'll have to get creative with that. Also, while we're up here, I we have this thing on the counter that kind of holds our everyday sort of items. Like Tyler's got a shave kit that I'm gonna try to find a new place for that to live. But then there's some overflow things that wouldn't really fit in the drawer. So I'm gonna try to clean this out. So this stuff I really like, but you're supposed to use it up within a year and it's definitely been more than a year and it's it's kind of dried up and not really working so great. So I'm gonna go ahead and let this go. Okay, actually we do have some more room in here. So I'll be able to tuck my deodorant in here. This face cleanser can just lay in there nice, but this lotion could just, Lay right there. Same with that. I will put this brush away though, because it's kind of gross. Okay, so here we are on the top of the sink. We just have this little holder. So we keep our rings here, drop off a watch or Fitbit, pair of lashes, <laughs> no, no big deal. Got my Lumify drop, got his shaving supplies, I've got my loche and my teeth holder. This drawer is a lot more functional. So this can come out if I really wanna like look around, you know what I'm saying? This side has more of the tiny items, a couple of moisturizers and makeup removers. These items I hardly ever reach for, so they're tucked away nice and neat. We've got a lotion, a body brush, and a dry oil. There's some face masks there. My hair drawer is significantly less cluttered now. And da 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 da! Don't judge me for all my brushes. This is the trash. That's a giant bag, okay? This is the bag of items that are gonna be rehomed. So we've got moisturizer, mostly hair things, 
mostly hair things. When is the last time that you went through all your items? When is the last time that you checked your expiration dates? Or even just thought about, when is the last time I used this? Do you have empty containers in your drawers? You might, you might. Take a look through your drawers, through your under the bathroom sink, and let me know what you found. Okay, so that I think wraps up this declutter and this little clean out, reorganization. It wasn't as painful as I thought it was gonna be. I felt actually really good about all the things that I decided to move on from. Thanks for coming with me on my little declutter journey. <laughs> You know, I'm nosy. I love these kinds of videos, so I hope that you liked it too. Let me know in the comments down below, what do you think? And I think that wraps it up. Make sure that you subscribe to this YouTube channel before you leave. I upload new videos here on YouTube every Thursday. You can also catch me on some of the other social channels and that's it for now. I'll catch you next week in next week's video. Bye. Wow. Hi guys. Welcome. Shit, shit, I'm not ready, I'm not ready. Oh God, my legs are asleep. What am I doing? God, my arm hurts. Oh wow, it's really loud. Oh, my back hurts. God, I'm old. That's not a drawer. Ugh.